It's middle of June, Lake of the Woods, and it is musky season. There's one, nice one, nice one, nice one. Got him! Oh! Oh, oh, oh. oh, what a creature. Highlight of my year. Today on the channel, we have two very special guests. They flew across the ocean just to fish with me, which I, I feel pretty special about. Today, we have Carl and Alex, Alex and Carl, whatever you want to call them. They are twin brothers from the UK. What do you guys do? Uh, we go carp fishing. <laughs> Mostly fishing, carp. Perch fishing and stuff like that. And you make videos? We make videos too, yeah. We upload them to YouTube for our English people to watch. And our North American people. And some North American. Yeah. Not many. Though. If you guys aren't subscribed, check these guys out. They catch all sorts of crazy fish, travel all over the place. Today the goal is putting them on their first muskie. We went out yesterday. If you want to see that video, Head over their channel, it'll probably be part of a bigger piece. We don't have a full day today, unfortunately. We got like a, a half day, but uh, it only takes one cast yeah. to catch a muskie. And uh, we're gonna see if we can burn these guys out. So that's the plan. We're off to Lake of the Woods and uh, we're gonna be hucking some big baits today. Good to go? Yeah, we're ready. It's muskie time. I wanna go fishing, these guys are just filming the whole time. <laughs> Sorry. It's all right. You guys good to go? Good to go. Is today the day? Today is the day that we catch the first carp on Lake of the Woods. Yeah. <laughs> Probably be more excited about that too, No. All right, life jackets are on. We are ripping down the lake and um, we got some overcast. This is actually much better than I thought. Nice cloud cover. These guys burnt bad yesterday. I'm gonna actually show you guys something. I don't know if you can see that. There's an outline where he missed his sunscreen yesterday. Are you okay being the butt of the joke? <laughs> I'm okay with it. I deal with it all the time. <laughs> I give him it. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Carl, what are you throwing? Uh, oh, I don't know. I forgot what it's called. Uh, blade. Blades, there you go. There you go. It's similar to corn. What are you using, Alex? I'm using a blade or bucktail. Do you also call it that? Yeah, you guys, they're both using the same thing. They're both using bucktails. My number one confidence bait on Lake of the Woods. But since I've caught muskies on Lake of the Woods and they have not, I'm giving them the blades. I'm messing around with jerk baits today. Um, something I haven't done a lot of, but it is what caught the one muskie yesterday and hooked another one. So I'll be throwing a jerk bait. We're gonna be focusing on rock, rocky points, kind of near spawning areas. That's what our buddy Darcy Cox from Tank Industries suggested. Um, he's on the water every day catching muskies, so you listen to him. And uh, yeah, we saw like half a dozen muskies yesterday. And this is where we ended the day. This is where we saw a great big one. Mm -hmm. And Carl might uh, poop his pants pretty quickly when we hook up with, would you, would you say Nancy was her name? What? Nancy the Muskie? <laughs> it was, I thought it was Fred. Frederick? Yeah. Okay, Frederick. Thirty-pound pike is crazy. How'd you catch that? Hmm. Oh, so the float went down. There's one. Nice one. Nice one. Nice one. This one's coming. Look at this, guys. This one's charged up. He's still there. Oh, she just nipped at it. She just nipped at it. Oh, that was my chance. Oh, I thought I should have caught that one. Holy smokes. Oh, that was a big fish. Oh, well, we just got our first proper look at a muskie. Bro, did you say proper? <laughs> first proper look at the beautiful muskie. <laughs> that scared me. <laughs> we got we got me. a good look at that one. I don't know if you can see it on the GoPro. Uh, it followed in the jerk bait and followed for like three or four loops. I paused it once. He didn't really make a move. Paused it a second time, and he lunged at it, and uh, didn't didn't get hooked. I don't know if he didn't open his mouth far enough or, or what happened. I mean, I, I don't think he really hit the lure that well, if he did hit it at all. He sort of went for it, didn't he? Yeah, he, 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 he went at it, but 
couldn't see what happened. But that was a four foot muskie or bigger. That was, that was a big one. We're going to where we saw two muskies yesterday, one little baby island. So hopefully they're there and uh, maybe this little different, different weather has them going, so. There's one. Oh, oh. 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 No. That was oh. devastating. He touched it. He I had him hooked, yeah, yeah. He just barely nipped it. That was huge as well. Oh. This is the spot. Musky Did fishing. Musky fishing is hard. It's so destroying. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Well, update for you folks. Um, we saw two muskies on this last spot. We saw two muskies here yesterday. And we saw two muskies here today, so that is definitely a new spot to get added to my repertoire. But uh, they didn't want to eat, so we're gonna keep moving. Uh, haven't seen any super active fish. That first fish we saw was the most active, but I think we're just gonna keep heading, heading into some dirtier water, and hopefully that makes them easier to uh, hook up with. So, all right. So this is where my heart was broken before. And I don't want my heart broken again, so I'm not even casting here. We're letting the boys make it happen. I give Alex my crank. Carl's using a jerk bait, and we saw two muskies here before. And one tried to eat my bait. My heart's racing. <laughs> this is the spot. There's a hungry muskie here. See that rock spine sticking out? He was just on this side of it. And he cast. I would do um, a little more like straight reels and then pauses. Okay. Rather than hard pops. Okay. That's just what I like with the big. Oh yeah, it's massive. Keep it moving. Yeah, yeah. Keep it moving. Yeah, you got him. You got him. Oh, yes. Oh. Yes. Grab the net. Grab the net. Grab the net. Right now. Right now. Oh, get under. Get get the net in the water. Get low. Get low. Get get it. Get, 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 get it. Get it. Get it. Yes. Yeah. Come out in the net. Oh yeah. 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 You done, go. <laughs> this fish nearly destroyed oh. us, and we've just caught him. We have just caught the fish okay, that keep drove keep us mental more. earlier. Oh, oh, oh my goodness! Out. Doesn't have, I've never freaked out like that. Give me a hug. Yes. Oh, oh Jack. <laughs> that was nice. it. Nice. That was it. All on the camera. I'm losing my, I was filming the whole thing. You were. I was yeah. holding this up for the oh, whole thing. This? No, that wasn't. That, I don't know if this was my chest. He was. Okay, oh, that's a beauty. All right. Okay, let's sort it out. Come on. <laughs> we got him. <laughs> <laughs> got him. The hook set. <laughs> Support him. Yep. Yeah. That is a 46 inch Lake of the Woods Muskie. Carl, you're shaking. In the figure eight. <laughs> that does not get any better. Does it look big? I'm speechless. It looks. I'm speechless. Massive. This is why we came out here. This is was going to be the hardest species to tick off of our list. And thanks to Jay. We've got it. Oh, what a creature. Oh, look at the length of that. Ah! <laughs> that is a beauty. Off you go, mate. Yes. <laughs> oh, my highlight of my year. That, <laughs> that, that capture, that will never leave me. That moment will never leave me. Well, we got I, it on video. I was so, <laughs> I was so certain. It wasn't gonna happen, you know? Just at that moment where you go, never, never gonna happen. And then it's following, it's following, um, bang. That is why you cast and cast and cast for that small moment. 
this fish, I don't know if that's the same one that missed my bait. It might have been. I, it very well could have been. And we came back and Carl did it on... What would you end up catching that on? Where's the bait? It was on the same one I've been checking the whole time. So Same time. The, that same look. The bronze Dadson bucktail. That's what did it. That's a little smaller size. It was probably size eight blades. You need a raster, but we'll review the footage. Mate. <laughs> f f oh, I'm, uh, I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> Thank you. Thank You're you welcome. so much. Yeah. Guys, that right there is just textbook of coming back on a hot fish. That is the fish that busted out of the surface, busted out of the water to go after my bait, and I missed it. We came back on it about an hour later. I, I picked up the camera because I just had a hunch that that fish was hungering to eat again. And uh, this is what it ate. Little, uh, little Datsun bucktail. I think these are eight size blades. And it just shows you when you have an active fish, leave it for five minutes, leave it for an hour, come back at sunset, whatever you want to do. But keep in mind because muskies are very territorial. They will stay in the same general area sometimes throughout part of a season. So just coming back to those fish is completely worth it. And it paid off and the boys got their first muskie. We're gonna muskie fish for another hour. Um, we gotta call it early today. But if you guys are not subscribed to Carl and Alex, go do it. They, they fish all over the world, do all sorts of crazy stuff. The nicest guys ever and you will love their content. They are fishing based videos. If you want fish, big fish, lots of fish, check them out. Um, we're gonna be doing some more adventures. Maybe we'll bring them carp fishing in Manitoba this next year. But uh, anyways, thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you're not already and we'll see you guys next time.